Today's question comes from viewer Jonathan. He asks, when I record my screen, sometimes I want to record part of a video that has its own audio. Then when I reproduce it, it's recorded, but I cannot hear the video sounds. How can I record not only the images, but also the original video audio, not my voice? Thanks in advance. Welcome to the video answers to your FAQs, how to record videos using PowerPoint screen recording. Okay, so let's get started. So what I've first done is I've opened up a brand spanking new presentation within PowerPoint. So the purpose of what I'm gonna do right now is I'm going to do two things. I'm going to insert a video into the PowerPoint presentation as well as I already have a video that's ready to play that's on my desktop. So I'm gonna try this experiment doing two things playing a video from within PowerPoint and then also um, playing a video on my desktop all while using the screen recording feature within PowerPoint. So in order to get started, you wanna make sure that you're on the insert tab and then you wanna come over here to screen recording. When you click on that, it automatically closes PowerPoint because naturally now the assumption is, is that you want to record something using some other platform or what have you. So that's what we'll first do. But I want to bring your attention up here to noticing that I have the audio activated. So this basically means when you see that it's grayed as opposed to not grayed, it means that it's going to capture the audio from my computer. I use an external audio uh, microphone called the Audio Technica AT2020. So that's plugged into a USB port in my computer and that's the audio that it's going to capture. The next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to select the screen that I want to record. So it's going to be this screen right here that I want to record. So the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to play this video, which has audio on it, so that I can confirm that it will get recorded once I start recording my screen recording. So I'm going to click record. It's going to count me down and you saw that window went away. All you have to do is just hover up there for it to come back. So let's play this video. I'm actually going to scroll back to the beginning and let's see if there's audio on here. Okay, so that should be enough. And then the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to open up PowerPoint and I'm going to come over to the insert button here. And I'm going to go over here to video and I'm going to go to my PC to find a video. I'm going to find the same one. Insert that. I'm going to just make it a little bit smaller. And then you can see it has a play button here. So in both those instances, videos played and had audio on it. So both here in PowerPoint as well as well as on my computer it played. Now when we're finished and we want to stop all we have to do is come up here and click stop. It then comes in over the same PowerPoint. I'll just move this so that you can see the videos there. So that's not a problem. So what we're going to do here is we're going to play this to make sure that this actually did what we think it did because remember all of this was recorded using a PowerPoint screen recording feature but I'm now recording everything so that you can see the back end using Camtasia. It went away all you have to do is just hover up there for it to come back. So let's play this video I'm actually going to scroll back to the beginning and let's see if there's audio on here. Okay, so that should be enough. And then the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open up PowerPoint and I'm going to come over to the insert button here. So as you can see, it worked. Not only did it capture the audio from the video, but it also captured my voiceover as well. 
So if you have any further questions in regards to screen recording using PowerPoint, please post them in the comments below. As always, if you found this video helpful, select like, and then also subscribe to my channel. If you're not subscribing, do leave comments in the comment section below because I do read them and I will create videos if you ask me to, or if there is a problem that you faced and you need to be walked through something, I will create a video for you and post it on my channel. So until next time,